I was like, it was a, a mid- really enjoyable I was movie. Five minutes into the movie, and I was already like, did they just delete Charlie from this setup? Huh? I think you just deleted Charlie from the oh, setup. Oh dang! Yeah, that had to have been Viridian, bro. Yeah, Viridian. He said, Charlie, you mean that? No, that he didn't even win the yesterday. Ex, the ex young prodigy. What what did Charlie get yesterday? Second. Second. Still really good placing. Charlie, obviously on the come up lately. Uh, he's been going super in. And I feel like <laughs> it's because uh, he's just kind of something finally the game clicked better, for yeah. him, and he's definitely not <laughs> hating his life as much. He. Uh, it's really since he took a trip over to Japan and came back, just looking so much incredibly Did he well. play Smash out there? Yeah. He uh, he beat, um, I never know how to say it. It's like Shaky or Shiki or something, the Zero Suit. Oh, S-H-K-Y. I, I thought it was Shaky. I thought it was Shaky. I think it's Shaky. Yeah, I, that's um, how I, I'd always yeah. heard it. Yeah. But yeah, he beat him out there, the Zero Suit, so that's really good that's for him. That's a really good win. Yeah. Yo, he got a lot of good practice out there. And uh, yeah, that's he's, tight. Uh, he's been looking really good since then. I can't wait to go to Japan. I probably won't play Smash out there, but <laughs> I want to go to Japan. That's fair. Um, that's like my life, lifelong dream, actually, ever since I was a kid. Nice. Viridian, though. I wonder how old he is. He kind of looks, looks like a kid young, himself. Yeah. yeah. He's probably like a teenager, though. He looks like he he's got a San Diego <laughs> dude. I'm telling looks you. looks like he could be his dad in, this, <laughs> in the business attire. <laughs> Father and son, yo, and Razo just all around responsible, man. He's got the the gaming glasses on, right? He's got am- yep. like amber lenses, yeah. Got to protect your eyes, man, especially when you're looking at video game screens all day long. Game number one, though, Final Destination Viridian with the Young Link uh, here against our uh, resident top player, Razo, man. Yeah, Razo, you know, I feel like. He always sneaks his way higher and higher on the PR. Yeah. Where's you know, he at right now? He's like fifth. Fifth. No. Yeah, he like shows up just super well, but no one oh. ever like talks about it. Yeah. All right, he should be able to still recover. He's going to go low. Pretty and taking 78%. He's going to sit back a bit. The thing is like, it's like, it seems like he's, oh, okay. He's committing to just like using projectiles a bit and then he just commits by going in when he doesn't need to. It's like... Yeah, but he is making it kind of difficult for Razo to get in, jump in on yeah. him. He has to pull back because he sees the boomerang coming. Right, and Vorian actually playing this one pretty well. Yeah, just yeah. putting out all these projectiles, making it so difficult for Razo again. Oh, oh he, dude! He, that yeah, I didn't look the greatest, but <laughs> nonetheless, Viridian picking up steam since the start of the match. Definitely throwing out a lot more projectiles and the uh, wall that he's putting on is very overpowering. All right, that should be a stock. No, the, does, not I'm quite. not sure if that was like a sour spot maybe. Yeah. I mean, it's sent pretty far for a sour spot, but he was just across uh, full stage, I think. Just like barely survived. Yeah. Uh, this is, this is this rough, man. This is looking difficult, yeah. yeah I'm, Kind of surprised Razo went to FD game one. Maybe he wasn't aware that Viridian was a young link player. Um, but this is looking really difficult for yeah. him. Nonetheless, he does get the neutral air. He's going to kill from across the stage. This is really just one conversion away from being like halfway there and Ooh. Viridian's controller disconnects for some reason. What? What the heck? His controller just disconnected. Wait, but it was like just connect. It, no one was touching it. Yeah, no like, one was touching it. Was it was plugged in. That was weird. That was genuinely, genuinely weird. Uh oh. Uh oh. That's nerve wracking. I'd be shook. <laughs> I'm shook if what, already. What do you even do right now? And you know what? If, that's just so unfortunate for Razo because he finally got an opening and that happened. Yeah. But maybe he got an opening because of that, you know? Like, maybe. Know. Maybe. Not sure. Yeah. Controller could have been malfunctioning. Who knows? Nonetheless, we're going to get right back into the game. Two stocks apiece. Reading with the bomb in hand for a bit. Yeah, Razo kind of starting to get a little bit of momentum right now. Maybe uh, that was just a little bit of mental damage to Viridian that Razo was able to take advantage of at the moment. Okay. Faring right through the arrow. Yeah. Uh oh. 
Oh, that hit? That uh -oh, hit? Oh, he's gone. Yep. Oh, that one just, that one looked extra strong. Yeah, I don't even think that third turn up was necessary. He was going to be gone good either measure. way. But good measure. Yeah. <laughs> Definitely looked a lot cooler than just letting him drop to his death, you know? Yeah. Way swag. Yeah, and Razo's really starting to figure this one out right now. He gets one opening, and Viridian is kind of getting a little too aggressive with his landing, oh, I think. Oh, man, he had that option covered right there. He just pulled the trigger a little bit too early. Razo just eating that bomb with the forward air, and that was a reverse hit of forward. What? I, what is Peach? Peach is a character that loses 20 matchups. <laughs> oh. Jab to grab, or should I say? Jab. Jab. <laughs> jab, jab, to jab, gab. It's a gab. A grab jab. Oh. I back throw for Razo. And right now these turnips are just doing so much work, making it so difficult for Viridian to get yeah, onto the ledge and the trade yeah. right there, not in Viridian's favor. That's nutty, man. Game number one going to Razo. Uh, it, it did look a bit rough. Viridian definitely playing to the best of his ability here and doing a fine job of contesting with Raza in the neutral. Uh, the first two stocks, well, the first stock, I should say, very even, and Raza having a hard time it actually was the first to lose his stock. Yeah. And you can see he just took a lot of damage from it, like about 70%, 80%, until he, like, it clicked for him. Like, okay, yeah. I, I know your patterns now, and I'm going to approach and... Exactly, and I think that's like, exactly what yeah. it was, is Razo had to take that stock to figure out the timing and the pattern, because yeah. every projectile player kind of has their own patterns, yeah. um, and they work, and the, that's not me like saying anything bad about zoners or anything, it's just, it's just the, that's how the characters work, is they fall into a pattern of, they can't cover everything at the same time, and it's like a Mega Man boss fight. Exactly. That's Where a perfect example. Yeah. Eventually, you figure out the pattern, and you're like, okay, now it's my turn to play the game. And Roz is one of those players where once you give him his turn, he takes, he get, he has like the Uno like skip. He's got the turn around, like <laughs> he, he got, draw four, he get, like he combos on you. He's got like a hand just full of wild cards ready to go. <laughs> yeah. Still, nonetheless, for game number two, seeing a bit of a similar situation as the last game. Uh, strong start for Viridian, about 20% in the lead here. All right, looking for a down tilt into the near, but it's not gonna connect. Good air dodge from Viridian, just trying to reset, but Razo calling out the jump with an up air parry, but doesn't find a back air afterwards. Okay, that's something I wanna see a little bit more of is those uh, falling fares. You can start to mix those in. Kinda caught uh, Razo off guard. I'm not sure if it was even intentional from Viridian though. I'm not sure, but that was actually a really good recovery from Brian, just snaking right under the lip of the ledge so he wouldn't get clipped by the Z-Drop turnip. Oh my god, that, that, I was scared that up smash may have got him for a bit. Oh, he's out of a jump. The bomb, he's the bomb. He's got a bomb, nice. There it is, perfect coverage from Razo going off stage with those toad edge guards. Is that it? Not quite. Not quite. <laughs> Did you see a despawn right when yeah, he threw right, it? Yeah, <laughs> that would look so weird. I didn't know that was a thing. Apparently, they're on a timer. I guess so. Yeah, I've never seen that. I don't know if it's like a timer because it like it must be a timer. Really. I like can't Mega think it would like, be anything else. Mega Man's like uh, Metal Blade like it has like a random. It, it's not the same amount of times that it just like randomly disappears. And that's what Peach needs more randomness. <laughs> more RNG, bro. At least Dude, we I swear, the more I learn about this dude. character, the more it's starting to sound like, you know, like, ba -bombs. the seventh grade single is so random, like. All right. Good coverage there from Razo. T drops the turnip, doesn't get much out of it. Oh, wow, that's ready unfortunate to... for Viridian. Yeah. Oh, that's a big punch. Just going to be a photo. I feel like Razo maybe could have got more off of that, but just going to go with what he knows. Right, yeah. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Like, maybe he could have racked up more damage with, like, a, a down smash or something. Like, I don't, I don't even know. Maybe he down, hit a down tilt into something. I mean, off of a jump in, it was definitely the most he could get. Yeah. Uh, not sure if he was able to, like, charge something just outside the range of the up B and still hit it. 
Uh, could be wrong. Wow. Okay, forward air. Whoa. Oh. Did he air dodge into the blast zone? No, the bomb blew him up. Oh, okay. Because it looked like he was about to survive for a second there. I was, I was shocked either way. Razanak is still hanging on to the second stock, 86% now, and look at it. He takes the stock lead, and he's like, all right, well. I like that they added parry because it makes like a mini game for when you're fighting projectiles of like, can I parry this one? Oh, okay. There's that thing we were talking about, man. Once Razo gets his turn, and the, takes the it all the way. Card, man. He called, he called Uno before Varian did, like. Yeah, he's just stacking the cards up on Viridian here. Nice coverage with the back air. Oh, just the auto cancel Peach Bomber into an immediate back air Viridian, not ready for the mix up. He did not think the turnip was saying that way. Yeah, that was really weird. Forward air getting ready to kill from across the stage now. Pretty much anything in Peach Arsenal is going to take a KO. Imagine him pulling a bomb, like, just just for a good measure. Wow, that almost, oh, okay. The thing is, he can just, he, it's so hard to challenge Peach's yeah. up here. Like, like, he just floated back to the stage, like, huh? Yeah. It's so hard. Oh, oh that was what? the up air, man. That had to have been the up air, and that's going to do it. The neutral air out of yeah. shield. Razo taking it with the two stock.